Okay, so what is the abbreviation form of the risk? It came from reduced instruction set computer. Tahole amande risk taki reduce wala hoche and this was the complex instruction set computer. So what is the difference between uh, risk and CISC? Obviously, we have reduced money. We have instruction set size comparatively it's less than then the CISC. That's why it's reduced and also much more simpler. And also it, as the size is fixed here, so it's easy to as also the size is fixed here, Amadeta use car journal ho chege, tamun beshi complex ba ho chege beshi size and nito ho chana. And Amadeta performance to overall thick taktasa. So, RISC is a type of microprocessor architecture that utilizes a small, highly optimized set of instructions rather than a more specialized set of instructions often found in other types of architectures. Tahole ekhane ki bolte se a microprocessor architecture eta hocche shob chete kom size ke nite se and it utilizes that but here is the problem amar hocche ki size ta instruction set that is always fixed and what is the amount of the size it's 32 32 bits uh rather than more specialized set uh, set of instructions often found in other types of architectures. So here is the history of the RISC. The first RISC projects came from the IBM, Stanford, and also the UC Berkeley in the late 70s and early 80s. Uh, the IBM 801, Stanford MIPS, and Berkeley RISC 1 and 2 were designed with a similar philosophy, which has become known as RISC. And certain design features have been characteristic of most risk processors. So, characteristic risk It has one cycle execution time. Risk processor have a CPI clock per instruction. So basically, the clock time is fixed for each and every instruction in the risk. And it execution time the one cycle as the time is fixed current camera size the fixed and we know uh, how many bits has the instruction set this is due to optimization of each instruction on the cpu and the technique called pipelining key use kora hoche pipelining use kora hoy pipelining the key it is a technique that allows for simultaneous execution of parts or stages of instructions to more efficiently process instructions. So, pipelining is a jeta hoche. Suppose we have a process simultaneously because it's working with the segment one. Simultaneously, there will be another process will be working such as S2, okay? And in this match, we will have the interface register. Can we catch it? Suppose we have the input and if we get the output, we need to store that in a register and that data will be used by the S2. কিন্তু এখান থেকেই যে আমি আমার আউটপুটটা পেয়ে যাচ্ছি ইজ নট ম্যান্ডেটরি ঠিক আছে এটাকে প্রসেস করা হবে এস2 তে দেন আমার আরো হচ্ছে কয়েকটা ধাপে হতে পারে এস3 এন্ড এস4 সো প্রত্যেকটা ধাপের মাঝখানে আমরা একটা রেজিস্টার কাজ করব এইটাকে হচ্ছে কি আমরা কি বলে থাকি পাইপলাইনিং পাইপলাইনিং এ কি হয় এই যে এস1 এস2 এন্ড এস3 এগুলা কি আমরা সিমালটেনিয়াসলি কি সাথে কাজ করতে থাকে এমন না যে s1 টা আমার শেষ হলে s2 টা শুরু হবে আর s2 টা শেষ হলে s3 শুরু হবে ইজ নট ম্যান্ডেটরি অল অফ देम আর ওয়ার্কিং টুগেদার দ্যাট ইজ নোন অ্যাজ দা পাইপলাইন 
So here the large number of registers, the risk design philosophy generally incorporates a larger number of registers to prevent in large amounts of interactions with memory. register use register memory store different way Tahole is clear, risk table to keep us the same. Confusion found the book of our and repeat the same. I guess it's clear now. Tahole uh, Shamni, the what are the attributes of risk? The main characteristics of CISC microprocessor are Kiki uh, Chilo Amade, extensive instruction Chilo, complex Chilo, and micro encoding of the machine instruction and extensive addressing capabilities of memory operations and also has the few registers. Current Okanama memory thing, I may operate Kore, Amun data school again, memory thing. Store code the bottom. That's why my registers are shown. How much is it? How much? Now, when we compare the Ashish system, that means the most important thing is that the instruction set is reduced. That means it's not uh, huge like the CISC, and also because of the reduced and fixed version, it it, it is less complex, and it uses only the simple instruction. Simple money for check is suppose addition multiplication is on a simple instruction such so, as it can be used. But it doesn't mean that we have to check on a complex code. We have to check on a small effect instruction. Suppose addition multiplication is fixed instruction. Suppose we have two instructions. We have to add a complex instruction. So we have to check on the risk and monthly amaji simple instructions for Taka Miguaki combined core. I can use a more complex instructions also. And hardware control unit and machine instructions, few addressing schemes for memory operands with only two basic instructions load and store. Tahole Amar addressing scheme. Addressing modes to come and also basic instructions like load and store the which use Karahai Kisha Junamande register Jahanamra load Kori Autonomy memory to store Karajuna instructions for the she Paki Shoma use Karahai. Many symmetric registers which are organized into register file. So these are the basic attributes of risk processor. Akhonashi, what is the pipeline in the risk? So a risk processor pipeline operates in much same way, although the stages in the pipeline are different. While different processors have different numbers of steps, uh, there are basically variations of pipe used in the MIPS R3K processor. Tahole Amar risk pipeline ki ki korte sa it fetch instructions from the memory, read registers and decode the instruction, execute the instruction or calculate an address, access an operand in data memory and write the result into a register. Tahole mujha ke se ki ki hotcha? Achha, I to clear Kore. Amar risk pipelining in ki hoy amar different processor different step thakte pare and it can take different amount of times. Like you can ekta amader simple example there sir. Ekhane dakhen this is the time and ekhane hocche amar task order. Task ki ki ase A B C and D. Now, if you have a 
পয়সাটা হচ্ছে একে এক এ টাস্কটা এতটুকু সময় কমপ্লিট একদম হয়ে যাওয়ার পর এই টাস্কটা স্টার্ট হইছে এন্ড দেন এটা এন্ড দেন এটা তাহলে কি আমার একদম মিডনাইট পর্যন্ত চলে গেছে না ইট টুক আ লট অফ টাইম হিয়ার বাট ইন দ্য পাইপ প্ল্যানিং হোয়াটস হ্যাপেনিং সাপোজ দিস টাস্ক ইজ প্রসেসিং হিয়ার অ্যাট দ্য সেম টাইম দ্য ডেটা ক্যান বি ইউজড ইন দিস প্রসেসর অলসো দিস ওয়ান ইজ প্রসেসিং হিয়ার and this will be used at the same time and also at the same time so here you can see the time is much less than the before one isn't it age amader midnight lagche but now we don't need to wait till the midnight amar hocche char ta task ki amar jothesto kom shomoyer modhe completed hoye jacche so e je ekhane jeta processor skula e different এ আর বি আর সি আর ডি এই প্রসেসরগুলোতে হচ্ছে আমার ডিফারেন্ট স্টেপে থাকতে পারে ইট ডাজেন্ট হ্যাভ টু বি ফর দ্য সেম স্টেপস তো আমাদের রিস্কের মধ্যে যে হচ্ছে কি পাঁচটা স্টেপ ইউজ করা হয় সেটা কি হচ্ছে আমার প্রথমে হচ্ছে ইনস্ট্রাকশনটি ফেচ করা হয় কোথা থেকে মেমোরি থেকে অ্যান্ড দেন আমার কি করা হয় রেজিস্টার স্প্রিড করা হয় অ্যান্ড দেন ডিকট দ্য ইনস্ট্রাকশন অ্যান্ড দেন এক্সিকিউট দ্য ইনস্ট্রাকশন অর ক্যালকুলেট অ্যান্ড অ্যাড্রেস অ্যান্ড দেন এক্সেস অ্যান্ড অপারেন্ট ইন ডেটা মেমোরি দেন ইট ইজ রিটেন অন দ্য রেজাল্ট টু আর রেজিস্টার আচ্ছা আপনাদের একটা এক্সাম্পল দেখাই সো দ্যাট ইট ক্যান বি মাছ মাছ ক্লিয়ার ইটস example as before okay so here we have the memory so we have x and we have y from here it will be we have one register ra and another register r b and we have the execution section okay সো এখানে আমার যেটা হবে এক্সকে আমার আর এতে মেমোরি থেকে ফেচ করে রেজিস্টারে লোড করা হবে ওয়াইকে আমার মেমোরি থেকে এনে রেজিস্টারে লোড করা হবে দেন আমার এই দুইটাকে ইউজ করে এক্সিকিউট করা হবে অ্যান্ড দেন আমার আলুকে মেমোরিতে অথবা কোনো একটা রেজিস্টারে রাখা হবে এখন বুঝতে পারছেন হাউ দ্য রেস্ট ইজ ওয়ার্কিং কোনো কনফিউশন থাকলে হচ্ছে বলেন আই উইল রিপিট ব্যাক আচ্ছা আই কেস নেই সো সো হেয়ার আর দ্য ডিসঅ্যাডভান্টেজেস অফ রিস্ক লাইক দেয়ার ইজ স্টিল কনসিডারেবল কন্ট্রোভার্সি অ্যামং এক্সপার্টস অ্যাবাউট দ্য আলটিমেট ভ্যালু অফ রিস্ক আর্কিটেকচারস ইটস proponents argue that risk machines are both cheaper and faster and are therefore the machines of the future tahole ekhane ki hocche ekhono hocche jeta amader risk er size ta hocche ki actually small and fixed that's why there is a controversy among experts about the ultimate value uh, and its proponents argue that risk machines are both cheaper and faster obviously it's cheaper because it needs the fuel of the memory it doesn't need a larger amount of the memory and that's why it's also faster and there are therefore the machines of the future however by making the hardware simpler risk architectures put a greater burden on the software is this word the trouble because conventional microprocessors are becoming increasingly fast and cheap anyway tobe joto jai hok in my case risk is better than the cis so it doesn't have that much disadvantages but the experts are worried about its size and its performance the limitation of its performance uh, so here is the differences between 
emphasis and risk. So what are the differences? Emphasis on hardware, it emphasis on software, and it includes multi-clock, it includes single clock, and it has the complex instructions, it has the reduced instructions, memory to memory, load and store, incorporated in instructions. memory but you can register to register it's independent and small code sizes high cycles per second low cycles per second large code sizes and transistors used for storing complex instructions spends more transistors on memory register can risk and the differences between them here is the designs of both of them. So this is the architecture of the RISC. Here you can see a hardware control unit and data path and instruction cache and we have data cache and also we have a main memory here. Now we have a hardware control unit and data path our instruction cache and data cache hoche ke store kora hoy so that amar je gula ke sobche beshi use kora hoy je instructions gula ke so that we can fetch that or use that faster in where in the control unit and je gula sobche kom use kora hoy gula ke kothay store kora hoy memory te tahole memory theke amar instruction and data ami hoche fetch kore data data path and hardware control unit we are using that so basically here two buses are using bus one and another bus one bus is for the instruction another bus is for the data and in the CISC architecture here you can see we have the microprogrammed control unit and we have the unified cache. the control memory and cache main memory that has the combination of both instruction and data. Cache and then instruction and data path. Then we do the execution on the control unit using the microprogrammed control memory. Is it clear?